Can you at least move your butt out of the way so I can vlog? Move your butt. How'd you like to spend Vlogmas with Vlogging Noobles? How'd you like to spend the holidays with me? How'd you like to spend Vlogmas with Vlogging Noobles? How about you hit that subscribe button? It's free. I hope that you are all having a wonderful Thanksgiving weekend. Um, today, it is Saturday, we are, it's not really morning, it's actually noon, but we're heading out to go get a, pick up a few things. Um, actually, uh, if you watched my vlog last night, I uh, told you about the harrowing tale of, um, of not, not functioning lights or um, extension cord. Um, my dad decided to go out this morning already to uh, get those, but we do still need to go out and I need to get some more food for my cat. He has a very special um, prescription diet, so I can only get it one place. So that's where we're going. We're going to probably, we might look around a few more places, but I just figured I'd take you along with me. Hello everyone. So we have returned home from out shopping. I didn't really I guess take y'all with me like I did I just have a weird thing about filming in public I don't know a little awkward maybe I'll get there one day but we got my cat his food so we got Nico his food he eats Royal Canaan urinary SO it's, I don't normally give him the moderate calorie one because he's not like overly overweight but this is the only one they had and it's just it helps him with his uh, urinary and blad bladder problems it keeps them from, uh, I don't know if you guys know this, but sometimes cats can actually get UTIs or urinary tract infections uh, because, oh. <laughs> hello buddy, Miko, thank you, hello, <laughs> Miko wants to be a star right now, All right, come here, ma'am, okay, hi buddy. Oh, okay. Can you at least move your butt out of the way so I can vlog? Move your butt. Thank you. So yeah, Miko. No. Miko. Alright, we can deal with this. So Miko, he has he had an issue a few a couple of years ago where he um it really hurt him to go to the bathroom. He was yowling in his litter box. Um, and I took him to the vet because I googled <laughs> why is my cat uh, having issues going to the bathroom and I heard that you know a blocked bladder not being able to pee can actually kill a cat so of course I freaked out but that wasn't the case he just had some crystallization in his in his pee he just had some crystallization in his urine which basically feels like peeing out sand so it really hurts and was kind of giving him some pain so this food basically um, makes sure the pH balance and the acidity So basically his food just makes sure that doesn't that he doesn't have any more issues with crystallization. So he's so he can pee so he can pee freely without pain. Excuse me. <laughs> So he can so he can pee freely without pain and we also uh oh ow ow okay and also after we went to pet smart we got a few other things um out and about and i'm excited to show you what we got um i really wanted to start a tradition of doing advent calendars because i never really did an advent calendar growing up and i thought like hello <laughs> i thought that an advent calendar could be fun Quit calling me. So I thought an advent calendar could be a lot of fun, and I um, ha got one from my, I got one from my mom too. I couldn't find the one I was looking for for my father um, because I really, if anybody knows my father or if you don't, what you need to know about him is that his favorite food in the world is peanut butter. Like he puts peanut butter on everything, and I'm not exaggerating everything. So I saw that Reese's has a 
<laughs> Miko has a peanut butter calendar, or a Reese's peanut butter calen advent calendar, and I was hoping I could find it, but I didn't. Maybe I can find it um, tomorrow, like the start day of advent, <laughs> but I hope I can find one. But I did get one for my mom and one for myself, and I will show you those later. So I have a surprise for you, mom. All right. Put your hands out. Stick your tongue out. <laughs> I'm kidding. All right, open your eyes. You got an advent calendar, a chocolate one too. Yeah. For you. For me. What'd you get for you? You'll see. You got the Harry Potter one, didn't you? Maybe. Spoiler <laughs> alert. But I got you a dark chocolate one. This is a. It's from World Market, so it's good dark chocolate. Mm. And it's. Uh, they. I think it's a from cacao farmers in Ghana. So it's very worldly. So are you excited to start it tomorrow? Sure, it's vegan. <laughs> it's vegan, it's healthy. So as my mom said, I did get the Harry Potter Lego advent calendar. I've been eyeballing this for like months since I've been, I started researching like back in September, Harry Potter um, advent calendars. And this one was the one that I really wanted. So I was really happy um, that Target had it in stock when we were out and about. So I was very excited about that. Okay, so here's the advent calendar right here. It comes in this box and it's a 24 day advent calendar. <coughs> I don't know if you heard that in the background, but it is currently the Iron Bowl right now, which is if you are from Alabama knows that's the game between Auburn and Alabama. So you might hear a little bit of cheering in the background. So I have it upside down here because you, once you take it off the tape, you put it down here. This is what the advent calendar looks like and it has a nice little area for you to put all your Lego builds after each day. Pretty. So the Iron Bowl is over. For those who care about college football, Auburn just won. Um, it was 48 to 45. And hey daddy, the only Alabama fan in this house. How do you feel? Life goes on. <laughs> yeah, we're not that obnoxious in this household. We're not somebody that'll punch walls if um, our team loses. I know a cu couple of people like that. We are gonna return to putting the lights on the tree now that we have an extension cord that didn't crap out on us and that we have a, a brand new pair of flashing lights. So I'll be showing you the finished product now. on top ooh this sits perfectly we've had trouble in the beers past look at that mama <laughs> 